For Boeing Chief T-7 pilot Steve Schmidt and fellow Boeing test and evaluation pilot Bill Berriman, a critical engine restart test in mid-air will prove the new advanced trainer's ability to restart the engine if a flight crew ever has to shut it down during an emergency. With a safety chase plane in the T-7's shadow, Schmidt and Berryman quickly climb from St. Louis Lambert International Airport en route to the test area. Engineers focused on the moment. In seconds, the T-7's only engine will be purposely switched off, leaving Schmidt and Berryman in a cockpit of a dormant aircraft. One final go-round. Fuel. Amma. Berryman declares their position. Red 6722, about to start a descent to 10, 000, And the engine is shut off. Flight test power is off. Caution. Caution. Boost low. Boost low. Your blood pressure kind of goes up when you shut the engine off. Uh, you're only engine airborne, but uh, you're just following your procedures. You're looking at what you expect to see. Then, after 48 seconds without power, Berryman pushes the engine restart, and the T-7 is brought back to life. 72,000, looking good. All right, flight test power is back on data. Fantastic. So it worked as expected. What really gives me the confidence to go up there and be willing to go ahead and shut the engine off. I've got that great team backing me up. We have confidence in the system and that goes into the airplane now. I mean, we're just proving it to everybody else that this airplane is very robust and it's safe and it's going to be a great pilot trainer for the U.S. Air Force. Back red 6-7 is going to maintain 4,000 meters to initial. Switch tower now, red 6-7. There's the takeoff. Acceleration. Set to prove out the Boeing T-7A in inverted flight, Boeing test and evaluation pilots Matt Giese and William Berryman are the first to take the advanced trainer developed for the U.S. Air Force through a rugged series of maneuvers, testing the jet's fuel system at all angles. Maneuver item 960. Cutting through the skies over Missouri, the agile advanced trainer lines up for the first crucial test point as a chase plane follows. Okay, uh, Bravo's visual, we're starting to close. Tally -ho. Go. In three, two, one, now. Rolling the jet over, the head-up display gives a pilot's eye view, icons spinning, as a cockpit camera captures the world turned upside down for the air crew. One, two, three. Throughout the series of a dozen separate inverted test points, some as long as 12 seconds, multiple air crews prove the Saab-designed fuel system is efficient and reliable in the advanced trainer as it prepares for a light of future training missions and beyond. 5-3, data copy it. Throttle, throttle. 5-3, data complete.